2014. Call this meeting to order. I'm uh, Jamie Roll Call. Murphy? Here. Goucher? Here. Strong? Here. Item 3, approval of warrants and claims. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Item 3 approved. Item 4, approval of minutes last regular meeting, January 30th, 2014. Second.
motion for district one approving it. Second. All in favor? Aye. Reports the following. County Clerk, Court Clerk, Health Department, Sheriff's Office, Treasurer's Office, Election Board. I'll make the motion for all of you have. Second. Do I have them all? Mm-hmm. All in favor of the report? Aye. 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 All right. Discussion possible action regarding monthly appropriations. I'll make the motion. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Mr. Did the, did he hit the side of the train or was it the <laughs> engine hit the train the other day? Yeah, or? I think it is. I know you couldn't get stopped because of the ice, but I didn't know what. He slid out just, just far enough the train hit him just ahead of the steer axle. Right, but was the train, did he hit the train? Was it already going through or was it the engine? Was it coming? He couldn't stop. Oh, no, it, it was the engine. Okay. He slid out in front of the engine and just got about a foot out. Okay. I, I wasn't ever sure, didn't hear, and knew it happened, but I didn't know whether he just couldn't stop or maybe hit the train as it was already going through the intersection or. He or, uh, it knocked the truck out of the way. Knock the front end of it around out of the way. That didn't hold them up very long when that happened, then. Just the front bumper and the. Didn't derail anything or nothing. How fast that train runs through your comma there? Well, I had heard that six or eight months ago they had a speed limit on that track. It makes me wonder. It is from Avar to out there east to end at 70. And it starts making those curves out in there on the way back around. Even through town there? Good to go. Yeah. yeah. Far enough. Same as it is more up there. Mm. That's what I've been warning my guys to get out there east to Avar. There's a couple of those out there that's got trees around. They're pretty well hidden. That train come out of there in a hurry. And there's some of these deals that are on an angle to where if, if, the, if the train's coming this angle and the pickups coming from this angle. They're pretty wide. They just get to get used to not paying attention and catching them. That first one that happened over there a month or so ago, it was already approved and here your gates put on that. It one in a bar and there's a couple of couple of crossings real close together there because they just Nip off the corner of a section. I don't, know, I don't know if that's a situation where they can eliminate the crossing by putting gates on one and then. I don't have that. Big talk of land other than the sell the strip of land and all that stuff. Yeah, we can. And I talked to Clay and Odog about these after the second one the other day. I'm sure they have. They didn't have any more money in their pot to work with this year. 
those are your closing home or that your gate won't finish you up? Oh no. I still got all those May Barnes to Hopeton. I owe two or three East of Hopeton. I've got mm -hmm. a couple of them from May Bar to Winokia. You know people just watch so many mice. Item mm -hmm. 9, discussion of possible action regarding inventory resolution to trade D2, John Deere Skid Steer, with John Deere on state contract. Here it is. Spend your money make the motion. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Well, it's no different than probably people running through a stop sign on the dirt road for the last 30 years, but now the traffic volume. Is catching them off guard. And we've got a whole different breed of people on the roads. And, uh -huh. That's probably 80% of it. Item number 10, discussion of possible action regarding title sheet project. That's what I'm doing. situation but if you're going to burn trash or whatever I said call it in no matter what you know you can't keep people from speeding you can't keep them from doing anything else but at least maybe we can save a trip if they call it in and uh, you can't you can't make them where they won't break the law I right, think right. determined to do that and uh, so I mean my only my only comment to that would be in a, in a situation where we have an extremely dry, dangerous situation and we really want them to abide by it, I think we need to continue to maintain the, the respect for it. You know, we, I hate to see folks losing respect for, for a burning band. But. 
what I can tell is just to dry under this snow as it was the day before it happened. But if you want to take it off for a week, look at it next week, I'm fine with it. I, I yeah. really, but I'll there. rely on you to tell me what I should do. Well, because you're the fireman. Not if one gets away from you, now, it's not going to run off. Shouldn't. I mean, you, might, you might get out of control. I'm not going to say it couldn't. But if you think you want to get out of control, that don't mean it's going to be a catastrophe. But if it'll get to 40 degrees, I think some of it might water and water with help. Right. The, the biggest concern that I would have is, is most of the folks that are wanting to burn are wanting to burn tree piles. And, you know, if there's large diameter logs, they can still be smoldering two weeks from now. When there's it's no question about that's that. True. That's everybody that's, if they've called me, I've cautioned them about that. I've seen that happen several times. That is good. Things last all winter, those tree piles. The net wrap stuff and stuff like that, you know, yeah, it's, it's they, they're, they're, there's two different scenarios there. Mm -hmm. um, Hindsight's always twenty twenty. There have been good conditions where they could get a lot of it taken care of, but you know what the future holds, we just have to monitor it. Right. Well, what caught us with this deal is is we went a week without a meeting. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know, and or uh, anyhow, I motion to lift it for this week and look at it in our next meeting. Well, I think it needs to stay on the agenda every week. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean is the way I feel about it. Mm -hmm. But I'm in favor of that. I'll second that. All in favor? Aye. Uh, Aye. Uh, I'm sure the phone will continue to ring today and I'll know what to tell them. Yeah. Exactly. Well, they got a pretty good window here to do some other thing when we get it done, so they need to get well, after it. Tree piles are still on issue. They always will be right. in the wintertime, no matter what. Right. And I don't know how you cure that deal because I've seen it, seen it burn in a good snowstorm. The only thing you, you know, hope for is that you know the grass is yep. green enough and it's wet enough and it won't run away from you. That's the only thing you hope for. Hope the wind don't blow. Right. Yeah. A lot of it is where they're at I, I and think, what's around. I think overall, the people doing the burning are doing a better job than they were 15 years ago. I think we see that. Uh, the number of folks losing control that we used to, they're, they're a little more vigilant about not just throwing a match in and, well, to get that control, we'll call the fire department. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I agree. I don't disagree with that, but those tree piles, there's no cure for that. They burn them down and it gets dry and they forget about them and it's two weeks and that thing starts. I mean, just like that, I don't know how long it's been since Ernest burnt that little hay pile out there that was on that day. He was gone, nobody was even around, and that thing just started smoking. I don't, there wasn't ever any live flames that anybody saw that day. So we just buried it with, covered it up with dirt and dug a hole and scoot, brought it all in there with the dirt to get rid of it so it didn't have to worry about it. But it's the same scenario that, you know, you go for weeks or months for that matter in this deal yeah. on those tree piles. Which is about the best we can do for them. I'm 12. Are you busy? I don't have it. I'm 13. Group disproved birth disorders? Blankets? Yes. Yes, sir. All in favor? Aye. Aye. I'm 14. Motion to adjourn? Yes. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye.